Hi everyone. Morning. Evening Aft and afternoon. Yes. Hello everyone. We've got a nice cappuccino, haven't we? Yes, in our little Disney cups. Yes. I treated us to a, cu a new cup each, so mine obviously L and J. Yes. LJ. Yes. Or so, JL. No, I'm the eldest LJ it is. Mind you, they always say age before beauty, don't they? <laughs> right, guys. You're higher than me. I'll have to get. I'll have to change my chairs. Look at this, guys. <laughs> I think this is the only time ever that she's taller than me, aren't you? Hey, because <laughs> she's a short, short form. Yeah, yeah. So this is today is a video which um, a few of you have been asking for, where you would like to see what June's been working on in um, January and February. So we've had a good chin wag and decided that at least once a month at the towards the end of the month um we're going to do a video i'll show you a couple of things what i've done but then it, um, i'm going to leave the floor then to june so could june can share with you what she's made what she's um but we're going to be showing some sewing as well aren't we yes so we've decided we're going to show some material that we may have purchased over the past couple of months and just say what we're gonna what I'm going what, what I'm going to make with them. Yes. Because I can't no, 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 no. No. It would not resemble whatever it is that you wanted. No. You requested, no. would it, Jude? No, not really. No. No. That's why I think my socks are gonna end up fitting Bigfoot by the time I've made them. They won't, guys. Have faith, June. Have faith in your ability. Okay. So do you want to start first with what your first of uh, your first finished project and I'll yes. just yes so I haven't got I haven't got two because like yeah so my first finished project is sorry about that my first finished project is my Stephen West sure everybody which is my very first, it's the right way. Yeah, Watch out. Which is the very first shawl I have ever made, and I am absolutely over the moon with it. Love, love, love the colours, and I shall be wearing this when we go to see Stephen West in September because we're all booked. We booked, guys. We booked to go to Amsterdam. Yep, and we're going in September. <laughs> so I'm... watch out, Amsterdam. <laughs> the Disney sisters are coming. <laughs> telling you, telling you. Yeah, so, and I, I was looking at this the other day and I was thinking um, I might incorporate some of these patterns in some little cardies I plan to make for Lyra, my youngest granddaughter. And some of the baby um, cardies I'm going to be making. So, yeah, I think some of them are beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, very proud of myself. Yes. Did you enjoy it? I did. I did. Um, I think it was, there was only one, wasn't there, that really got on my nerves. And that was that one. No, it wasn't. Which one was it, Linda, where we carried it up? This one. Oh, no, this one. Hold on. No, this one. This is the one. Yeah, this. We both had trouble with this one. I yeah. don't, won't even tell you how many times we frogged it. No. So she phoned me and she uh, FaceTimed me and said to me, right, you t stitch. You, you, sl you slip stitch that you carry on, you don't knit the next row, you carry it on. And I was sitting there and Bernie said to me, June, did you know your knitting's going tighter and tighter as you're going on? And I was like, yeah, that's not right. Something's not right. Just about to ring Linda to tell Linda that it didn't seem right and she FaceTimed me. Undo it. It's wrong. It's wrong. But so we yeah. had lots of fun with this, oh, didn't we? Did, yeah. We had we lots did. of fun making this yeah, together yeah. and... It, it was like, it wasn't a competition, but it was like, what row were you on now? Yeah. And I'd say, I'm on 23, and she'd say, oh, I'm on 30, and I'd go, <laughs> so I'd be like that then. <laughs> and then she FaceTimed me, and she said to me, I went, you finished, haven't you? She went, yes. So then the Wednesday, it was a rush job then for me to make sure I had it finished before the 1st of February. When we started our mystery, not our mystery knit along, our hashtag 
DSC Spring Shawl Make Along. Yep. So, but also, and it took us guys five weeks five to finish weeks. this. So we're so proud of each other. Yeah. And that. Uh, yeah. Really expected it to still be on the needles to tell you the truth, but yeah. Yeah. Very proud of myself. Very very proud. Of and myself. we've we've decided we're going to do um, the mystery knit along this year together, aren't yep. we, June? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. We're going to go and we're going to stand in a shop. She's going to be sniffing the yarn and I'm going to be. <laughs> and then we might just purchase a bit and then we're going to go away and then the next day we'll go back because we'll have decided what colours we're going to use um, to do the mystery knit along. It depends on how many, how many different yarns we have to use as well. Usually it's about five. Yeah. You, on on the on generally over the past couple of years it has been five. So I have only made finished hats this year, this month because we've been getting ready for our craft fair. Yep. And um, so I have made this lovely. It's like a minty green. Yeah, it is beautiful. And then, uh, and I've added my handmade logo and i've done this one i really like this all and the pom-pom is yeah. so soft yeah. it's like you know bunny rabbit oh so, so soft and then not that she knows what a bunny rabbit's little tail feels like but <laughs> and then this one i love this color i uh, love that color yeah it's lovely. lovely yeah i did do another hat but I gave that to my brother-in-law when we went away for the weekend. Mm. So I have actually made five. And this is this is my favourite. This is my favourite, the white one. I love this one. Cream. Cream. It's cream. It's cream, it's cream Linda, you know. It's no, cream. No. It's not white. It's cream. What do you think, guys? <laughs> Like butter would melt. No, butter would melt. Yeah, definitely, definitely. <laughs> so they are the only finished projects I've got for February, June. Yeah, shock horror, everyone. I know. Mind you, I've got 17 whips, June. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So my next thing that I've finished. What's it called? Colour? It's called... Spring Meadow. It's called Spring Meadow <laughs> and it's called Hi Addy. <laughs> and I finished it. But the difference with this one, this is the same one, I've made the sleeves a bit longer. So there you go. All finished. Doesn't it look isn't that and it's it's Wendy um DK and it is the softest acrylic. Yeah, I love it. Love it. Absolutely love it. And it washes nice, doesn't oh, yeah. it? Yeah, this has been washed about four times now. Love it, absolutely love it. Love it. I'm thinking of making another one. <laughs> oh, why not? You got the pink, didn't you? You got that lovely rose pink, didn't you? Yeah, we didn't Anti get enough for that. Oh, did you? I got you? that to make um, vests. Oh, um, yeah, you're making vests, a vest, yeah. aren't you? Yeah, yeah, so I really like that. I've got green pants on today, and it absolutely looks lovely with them. Yeah, she's got like a bottle green, yeah, yeah, a bottle yeah, green, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So I'm made up, made up with that one, made up. So easy to, to make. Would you recommend just... the pattern? Yes, definitely, definitely, definitely. If you've never done top down, I would definitely recommend this pattern for your first one. I've got a couple more different patterns, haven't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I've got a nice blue, a nice baby blue. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, look lovely yeah, in blue. Yeah, so, yeah. Maybe try it next time, try it in a different yarn. You know, kind of like the yarn that I brought home for you from Turkey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd love to I'd love to try and see if I could make it in the um the you know, the one that you gave me. Mm -hmm. I'd like to have a go at making one of them like that from the neck down in that kind of yarn because mm -hmm. I, I like them high I don't like them I don't like because I've, I'm big boobed I don't like she's got big girls yeah because I, I got little girls she's got big girls I don't like flashing me, me, me big girls 
I'm not one for that. So yeah. So I like this. This is just just right for me. Yeah. So I'm, I'm made up with that one. Really chuffed. Yeah. Oh, it's me again, isn't it's it? His, oh, yeah. look, that's me again. <laughs> well, it is all about you today. Yes. So, the only other thing I've got is two things. Um, I've just started making... So, this was in the loft. Attic. <laughs> and I, I was sorting stuff out and going through the bags, and I found it, and I thought it wasn't, it wasn't stitched together. It was just all in pieces, and I thought, why haven't I finished that? So how long ago? My little granddaughter is three in July. So that's how long ago it's been up in the in the attic, waiting to be finished. So I thought I'm making baby clothes. So I baby cardies and pram cardies. So I thought this can go in the little bag for me that I'm making. And I thought, yeah. So I stitched it together, which I showed on the live last week, didn't I, Linda? Yeah. And I'm going to, I've cast it on now for the, the bands and the neck. So I've got that one. And I'm also in the middle of making a blue one. Because a friend of mine's having a little boy. And I'm going to make her a couple of um, baby cardies. But it's very, th it's lovely thick yarn. I don't know, I don't know what, what yarn it is because I took the bands off. It must have, I must have used it for something and, yeah, and not. I must have made something yeah so um, so that's my next one so hopefully by the end of this month i'll have finished them too as well yeah i'll be on an, on my next one and i'm getting katie's top out of the garage do you remember the tea i made her? i was making her well she needs that because she goes on holiday in april so that's all my makes up to now that's all oh Oh, do you want to show something? No, it's all right. It's Are all you right. sure? Yeah. Okay. And then my hashtag DSC spring shawl. No, shawl. No, I can't. Make along. You can tell it's Linda that says it all the time and not me. <laughs> I haven't done. Oh, that's me on. That's all I've made up to now. But now I've finished me, me higher tea. I'm going to concentrate on. And she's got little llamas. Llamas. Llama June. Yeah. So that's where I'm up to, up to now. So, but we have got, we have got till April to finish it, haven't we? Yeah. So, yeah. So that's, that's it. That's all. So basically two babies, cardies and me, shawl on me needles. That's all I've got in my own special personalised cake bag I made. Yeah, because it's all to do with sewing, isn't it? It's yes. lovely. Yes, it is. I'll show it. It is. Hang on. Hang on. Let me just... Let me bead it a bit. I need to change the ribbon. I don't like the ribbon in I don't think the red goes. I don't know why I, uh, why I put red in. See? Look at the, all, the, all the different... All the different... It's all to do with embroidery, I think. And sewing. Yeah. 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 Lovely. Beautiful. Lovely, jubbly. Right, you can show now. So I'm working on three pairs of socks, guys. Would you believe it? Three pairs of socks. One pair is the uh, vanilla socks that I'm making. And I am up to the... I've done the ribbon. This is Giddy Yarns. And I'm up to the... Um, just doing the leg. So this is, I've done one, and this is the second. And so far, it's looking like they're twins. Go you. No flies on me, Gail. Telling you. I know. And then the second pair is our aunt, Toby Knits. Hey, honey, it's cold out. Socks. If I can find the picture. There we go what I'm doing and I am up to I'm still on the first sock but I'm up to I've done the heel turn flap and I've done the decreasing of the gusset so now I'm just on the foot 
and these are actually going to be a pair for Rick and the other socks that I showed you these are Rick's socks so that's them too and last but not least are my tits up socks by Nancy from Knit Zip Happy for her make along which is KSH Cal 2024 and I'm knitting these socks and these are going to be for me actually I couldn't really make these for Rick tits up and all that you know <laughs> so this is what I've done so far that's what I've done so far absolutely easy easy peasy pattern guys easy peasy I'm loving so I'm using this yarn is from my yarny corner Alex and I had a mini in my stash so I put them two together and I think the purple just pops that I just wanted a, a darker colour to go contrast with that and that's all oh and of course of course Is a butterfly June? Naughty Gale June. Remember the um, Disney bag that June made me? Well, she made me um, a sock bag for my um, socks. Socks, oh, isn't it lovely? So and she's forgotten to put the button on, so I'm going to have to sit this afternoon and put a button on. But other than that, thank you so much, darling. You're welcome. So that's all from me. So the rest now is sewing. Yes. So she's been a busy girl getting ready for our um, craft fair, our first craft fair for 2024. So we decided that the wrist bags that I was making for the socks, these, yeah, we weren't going to make them anymore. We've decided. So we decided. We thought we need something to replace it that's not big, massive, but that can keep hold them in with and t still have a strap. So I we came up with these ones. These, they've got the strap on. They're also zipped off. They have one pocket in there. And it's got enough room for, say, your little notepad, your crochet hook, um, a pencil, a pair Stitch. of scissors, and... Stitch markers. And then the tag. I thought you wanted to say something. And then a tag, mm -hmm. as which is what we always do with stitch markers in. And I just think... And show the bottom. And I've colour-coordinated colour them as best I can because I like... I don't. I love the way the tote bags have the square bottom and have a contrasting colour on the bottom. So, I've done square bottom, and they, as you can see, they are very, very wide, pretty wide. So they'll hold. That you could make, hold two pair. I mean, you could put two pairs of do two pairs yeah. of socks in here. Yeah. Easily. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I, with mine, yeah. you know. I mean, I've got only, and the pattern. I mean, in mine. You know, you can see there's one pair of socks in there and I, I've still got quite a lot of room. Yeah. So, yeah. I, I like looking at it, I reckon I could put a baby's card, card pattern. a project, baby's pa yeah, card a small project, project in there. Easy. Yeah. Easy. So, I've contrasted them all with different, um, different colours. Mm -hmm. I love this, this one. I love them. I, well, they're all my favourites. So the next one I did, I had this left over from our orange um, tote bags, and I think I put it on yours as well. Yeah, yeah. Is the fluffy grey, and this is with like the Vogue, isn't like, it? Yeah, it's like Vogue. It's still got the same same thing in. It's like a pocket for your notebook. Um, crochet hook or if you have like the, the uh, circular needles and you, you have the connections you could put your needles in there maybe put your little con your connection bit in there and there's enough room for a, I think I think Scissors. you get you get three three little pockets and then the one big one and I haven't I've just I didn't measure I just eyeballed I just basically cut them different sizes and you get the same as well. You, everyone has a stitch marker. 
a stitch holder for your stitch markers. You got so we've just got to sew the buttons on these yeah. and put add the stitch markers. Yeah, yeah. And then the next one is and I try to match the the lining. I try to make sure that the ma lining matches one of the colours. So the next one is like matches Linda's tote bag. I think you got the first one I ever yeah, made, didn't yeah. you? So again, big bottom. And then your pocket. This one, I made this one to have just one big pocket for a patterning. I didn't make that one with a, I don't know why. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know whether it was, I was going to have this one. Not too sure. And then your mark, your stitch marker as again. Yeah. And a zip. Our name on it. Just need to add our, yeah. Um, yeah. And they were so easy. Yeah. So easy and quick to make. Really. Sorry, just give me a minute. And that's the same. That's got the same colour bottom and then the multicoloured. And I give this one a pink in it with a little tab and then the pocket in front. It's got cotton there, that's why it wouldn't open properly. Mm -hmm. Just sort that out. Yeah. So they're all I'm just just pick the material up, seeing what we had, and I just made them just different all different sizes. We said these were twenty, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. 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 And yeah. we're selling these for twenty pound. Yeah. So. Because I went on to the Etsy to see all the different ones and the prices that some people are, are charging. This one won't open. Do that. And I was like, wow. This is nice. I love this one. I think we've got little bags with this one. So yeah. this one, I added. Because it's got the red. It's like, like French, isn't it? Like cafe, see? Like French. It's beautiful. It's lovely. Keep right. Yeah. It, 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 yeah. No, but it's in. Oh, yeah, it is yeah, French. Yeah. It is French. Yeah, because yeah, French jumps on. So I just thought, like, the red. I'll take the red. And, do, and so I did a, a nice big a red bar. And I think these are. A, I think it's better having this kind of a base on them myself. Don't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. I think if you put your bag down and, like, the, the, like when I come to Linda's, I come with, like, quite a few bags. So be when I get out the car and I've got them out the booth, I tend to put my big, massive Jones blanket bag on the floor. So I know that the bottom is not going to get dirty because it's got this on it. So, and I I just did the red on the bottom. I did red line, uh, grey lining, and I did a red handle. And it, it, that's the same. And a red, red and grey pocket in this one. So I just mixed and matched the colours on this one. Mm -hmm. And then once again... A, you know, a little tag for your stitch marker. Mm -hmm. That's what's that blue one now, that's sort of that out. And then the next but not least is, so as you can see they're all different colours, all different sizes, all got the same base on. And this is the blue one, I think we made a um, we made a, a tote bag, didn't we, with the um, with the drawstring top? Yeah. And this is the same. It's got a green lining, and then it's got the pockets on here as well. And then you've got a different. It's whatever one comes to. Are you, I mean, Linda did a short video of of my um, sewing room, didn't you? Mm -hmm. She shed. And on it, if I don't know whether if you noticed on the back behind the sewing machine, I've got these all hanging up, all different colours. So I just look and I think, oh, we'll jazz it up. We'll put that one in today. And a lot of people have commented that they'd like to see the full. Uh, uh, so what next month? I'm going to go to June's with my video camera, and I'm actually going to video June's she shed. So you can, and she's going to talk, talk you through, through everything, what's yeah. there and that. So. If you're really interested in that, a lot of people have, have said. And then the last one is this blue one, which I think is absolutely beautiful. I love the bottom. Really nice and soft. And again, I think the stitch markers need to put the stitch markers on. And again, the pockets and the lining is this lovely blue. Yeah. 
so yeah so these are June's been working really hard for the um, show for the show so yeah I just need to iron that one yeah hold on we'll just leave that kind of yeah show that yeah so that is the bags that June's made what do you think which one of your what which one was your favorite which one so we've got the spotty the the flower, flowers. the French one, the blue one, the air balloon, we've got the Vogue, and we've got the garden. Which one's your favourite? Um, I'd say the balloon. Yours is the balloon? Yeah. Mine is this one. The Vogue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. So yeah, so they they we're going to be putting buttons on them today. Yep. So have you got anything else that you'd like yeah. to share with us? So I thought I'd bring some material with me and just tell you what I'm going to make. So first off, you know butterflies were my mum's favourite, and blue is my favourite colour. So just before. I bought this before Christmas to tell you the truth. So I've got this this material um, and this is mine and I'm going to make um, a Simpson sock bag and I'm going to make a Disney bag out of it because I think it's absolutely gorgeous and when I make my um, Making a sock bag, aren't I? What mm -hmm. else did I say I was going to make with it? Disney bag. Yeah. Yeah. A Disney bag and I'm going to make a sock bag with it. And the bottom of it, I'm going to put a navy blue, I think. Yeah, navy yeah. blue would look really yeah. nice. Yeah. On my sock bag. Yeah. But then, I found this one as well. Isn't that gorgeous? Which absolutely is absolutely, gorgeous. yeah, yeah. Not too sure whether I'm going to make with this yet. I need a Mary bag, I think. Yeah, a Mary bag would look nice with that, yeah. with a, um, like a, a dove grey lining. No, well, I was going to make it in this one. And if there was enough left, I was going to line it in that. Yeah, you could but do. But then it might be too much. Yeah, it might be too much. Mm. Yeah, you need, um, you need like a... Um... Or I could make a Mary bag... Yeah. And do that as the base. Yeah, you could. To mix it up. Mm -hmm. And then do like a a white liner. Yeah, that'd look nice, yeah. Because mm. there's white on there, yeah. 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 What do you think, guys? Yeah. So they are, yeah, they're beautiful, aren't they? Mm -hmm. so I, d I was planning on having the, my bags made before Christmas, but never happened. Then... I've bought this one, beautiful pink, not a pink girl, but when I saw this material I thought that is absolutely beautiful, lovely, lovely. So, um, I don't know, I don't know what bag I'm going to make with that one. Uh, has anybody got any ideas? I will. I would do um, a Sheila bag, mm -hmm. the small Sheila bag. Yeah, yeah, could do. Mm -hmm. Could do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there's an, yeah plenty there, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. nice. That would look lovely, lovely. I try to use the cotton material, the co this kind of material, for all the smaller bags. And I like to use the like the thicker material. Oh, this is my favourite. So I try to use like thick material like this. It's not gorgeous. <gasps> A nice green line in June. Yeah. Oh. I, I like to use them for the tote bags. I think that would that's beautiful. And I've got like a um, I'm gonna make I am actually making that into a tote bag. Just an ordinary tote bag, no zip. With a green bottom. With a green bottom. That um, that bottle green, is it there? This one, this one. Mm. With that green. 
with that green bottom what do you think yeah and that's what i'm making that's going to be um, a tote bag that we will well if linda doesn't get her hands on it first that we will be putting on to our because once we've done this show yeah well, once we've done the show and we'll we're going see to, we're what going, we've got left what we've got left we're going to uh, have a disley sisters facebook page where we're going to put everything yep and the next one let me just fold it in half so you can see how beautiful is that isn't that lovely how absolutely amazing is that that that's going to be a tote bag yes and, and i bet that blue will go with that well i thought either that blue or, or the green or even the uh, the goldy colour oh yeah the gold can you see the, the gold colour on it this one yeah oh yeah that'll look nice wouldn't it yeah so you've got a choice there haven't you yeah 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 so they're definitely so i try to go for material like this I tried to go for material like this. Um, you know, the heavy duty. Yeah. Almost like curtain material, wouldn't yeah. you say? Yeah, it is. It is. I like to go for for something this kind for the tote bags because I think you tote bags. Um, and even for the blanket bag, the Jones blanket bag. Yeah. Because yeah. that is yeah. for the heavy duty. For the blanket it? bag and for the um but any of any of the bags that are like totish, so the Jones air uh, blanket bag and the tote bags definitely definitely go for um the thicker material. Mm -hmm. Um yeah, because if it's anything like my Jones bag, it comes everywhere with me. Everywhere, literally everywhere. Sorry, excuse the clink up. So the other three I've got is when Linda went to Lublin. And she went to her little yarn shop. She um, purchased some material to make some bags. So I think absolutely beautiful. So I think they, I'm going to make this into a Disley bag. Yeah, that would be a Disley bag. Definitely. You'll get a couple of Disley bags out of that. I reckon two. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, because I've got a meter of each, and it's beautiful, beautiful material, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, and I think I'm thinking like a lilacy, like a lilacy lining mm -hmm. with the handles, because I like to do on the Disley bags. I like to do the handles in a different color, so I like like your handles. See, I like your handles and your little Tab. things, your tabs and your pockets inside, your lining inside. I like them to be. Um, a colour like a pick a colour and then I, I'll I'll lay it on top and see which which like which talks to me and says yes it needs to be there yeah but yeah definitely definitely a Disley bag this one I think yeah yep yep beautiful beautiful purples isn't it yeah. it's a mixture though it's like purple and blues isn't it and lilacs yeah, yeah. beautiful beautiful and then another one Linda got me, which I think I'm going to do a Sheila bag in this one. Yeah. Um, is this one? I just loved the autumnal colours in this, guys. You all know autumn colours are my thing, my jam, apart from pink, uh, purple. And you know these colours are my jam, really. And I saw it and I just sort of looked at Rick and I said, I've got to get that. I've got to get a metre of that. Yeah. But I'm thinking, looking at the size of it, you could get a Mary bag out of that. A Mary and a Sheila. Would you get two bags out of it? One of each. Yeah. 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 Or if there's not enough to do... Uh, um, you could do one of the Simpsons sock Mary, bags. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I could do a sock, a, a Simpson sock bag and a Mary bag. Sheila bag. Oh, Sheila bag. Sheila. Do you reckon Sheila or Mary? Mary. Yeah, so Mary and I might even then, if we're not doing a Sheila, because that takes quite a bit of material, I might get a, um, a, a cake bag. Yeah. Might get three out of this one. Might do, yeah. Might get a cake do a cake 
Yeah, we will. We'll do a Mary, a cake and a... Simpson sock. Simpson sock bag. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And a nice orange zip. Oh, yeah. On the mm -hmm. Simpson sock bag. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With orange lining. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I know who love it, orange. That's our Jane. Me, Jane. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that'd be lovely, that. Jane loves orange. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. 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 So that was just, yeah, this was... This was, and I've only just realised now looking at this other material she bought that it's metallic. It's metallic. metallic. Oh, I didn't realise that. Mm -hmm. Oh, like a copper. Yeah. So. I think. No, not that one. Oops. Put the thread away, that one. Yeah. Yeah. So, the final material, she's always going to say material, um, is this one. And it's got all the music notes on. Can you see? All the musical notes. Beautiful. This is going to be a Disley bag, I think. Yeah. I think definitely, definitely a Disley bag. Oh, yeah. Maybe two Disley bags. Yeah. One each for us. No, I don't want another one. I'll have had two. You're just being greedy. <laughs> I've got two, so I can't have so, no. No, I'm we're thinking, good. I yeah. think it'd be nice. Yeah, two Disney bags and two cake bags. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah, easy, easy enough looking at it. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we need to find something to, for the handles that will go. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, yeah. Like a bronze, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a bronzy colour. Yeah. Might not be able to get bronzy. But we could always do black. Mm -hmm. With an orangey pocket. Mm -hmm. Black and orange looks nice together. Yeah, it does. Halloween. It does. It does. But mm -hmm. not for Halloween. Yeah. No. So this is going to be two Disney bags. And two cake bags. And two cake bags. So that's two Disney bags, two cake bags. That might even get something else out of it. Um, that's going to be a Mary uh, Simpson sock and a cake, mm -hmm. however many I can get. So and I will show. So that's four. Yep. So that's four. Yeah. Five, six, seven. Ten, yep. Seven bags. Two of these. Yep. Yep. That's nine. Yep. That's ten. Yep. Eleven. Yep. Twelve. Yep. And easily. Two each out of them. 14, 16 bags, guys. Watch yep. this space. Yep. Yep. All them. So which of those was your favourite? Which of those were your favourites? Was it one? Two? Three? Four? Five? That is beautiful, that one. Mm. Six, seven, eight. So which was yours? So when I've made them, I will show them. I'll bring them all together and we'll show them, won't we, Linda? Yeah, we'll show them. We'll do What we plan to do is once a month we're going to do kind of... Uh, um, it's going to be mainly all about June, what June's been working on, showing her bags, what she's made, or any knitting or mm -hmm. crocheting she's done. And um, that's what we're going to be doing, isn't it? Yeah. So this won't go live until Tuesday the... Next Tuesday. It's Thursday today, so we'll do it. it it'll go live next Tuesday. And um, by that time, we'll have done our craft, first craft here, won't we? So we're excited. Yeah. And um, nervous, excited. Because mm -hmm, yeah. it's the first pl place, uh, p craft fair, as in a craft, proper craft fair, yeah, yeah. that we're, we're actually doing. So we're looking forward to yeah. it. Yeah. And uh, we know there's a couple of our friends are going to pop by and meet us and never seen us before. So they're looking forward to coming and meeting us and saying hello. So we're looking forward to that. Yeah. And um, I think that's about all. Yeah. From you. From us. No, from, from you. you. From, from you. I'm going. Everyone, she's on her own now. <laughs> it's gone cold.
world, doesn't it? Nice then. Yeah. yeah. Never mind. Yeah. So thank you ever so much for spending time with us today. If you can't comment, leave a comment, just leave a thumbs up. If yep. you're new here, don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell icon to always get notifications of when June and I go live. We go live every other Thursday. I go live every Tuesday, except the last Tuesday of the month. And um, I have videos going out on a Sunday and when I don't do a live I'll have a video as well yeah so there's things coming up June and I are going to have an exec meeting on what we're going to do in the coming months aren't we yep yep so yep. take care everybody stay safe but more importantly guys be kind to you and thank you so much for being here bye, bye. see you soon bye bye